Hey guys, uh, finally got my voice thing on, so yeah. Today I'm going to show you guys how to connect through a, a laptop, so you can connect to Xbox, so, like, if you have an Ethernet cable, and you have a laptop, and you have an Xbox, and you don't want to buy the $100 wireless router, this is a very simple way of how to connect to Xbox Live through your laptop, with just an Ethernet cable, Xbox, and a laptop. So first thing you have to do is go to start, control panel, give it a second to load. <laughs> Alright, then you want to go to network connections, double click on that. And then, when your Xbox is plugged into your laptop, you'll have you'll still have the same things. But if it, if yours has like a red X on it, you want to right click on it. And you want to click Bridge Connections. Okay. All right, you want to highlight these two things, and right click, click Bridge Connections. It's going to say, please wait while your Windows bridges the connections. I don't have another Xbox hooked up, so I can't show you how it really works. I figured out how to do this a couple of days ago on my friend's day of the night, and he wanted to play Xbox, and he didn't have a wireless router. So this is a very easy way. All you do is plug in your thing, and you'll have another bar come up on the screen, a connection. And when your Xbox is plugged in, you just go on your dashboard, you go to connections, and you click scan, and then it will find that connection. So, let this find. See right there, that would be the connection that would work for your Xbox right there. So, when my, well, since I don't have two Xboxes, when my friend comes over again, I'll show you guys how to do this. Like, I'll show you a screen of the TV and how to do it. Alright, let this finish loading. So, this would be the, you want, you would want to keep the bridge right here. It's locked down. You, so, basically, this is all you have to do. You have to highlight on both, and you have to click Bridge Connections. Then with your Xbox plugged in, you go to your Xbox dashboard, you click Connect Now, and you'll be running through this thing right here. And then when you're done with it, you can just delete it. And you, you can do it whenever again, whenever you need to bridge them again. So, and when you're done with it, you just, which I'm done with it right now, right-click and you click Delete. You can also use the Internet while you're doing this, too. You don't need to have all this other stuff hooked up. So all this deletes. Uh, take the time to go scroll down and click like and subscribe to me. It means a lot to me. I'm kind of new. I don't have that many people. And thanks guys. If you enjoyed this tutorial, uh, please subscribe. Thanks.